Kana knew from the start that she was causing an entanglement. She held back her feelings so she could part with you with no regrets. She's a great person. I'm sorry. I know this hits the two of you harder than anyone else, and I'm here crying. Apparently, the entanglement will unravel when Wakana returns to the past and dies like she did in history. I know she would have wanted to talk to the both of you some more, but she thought spending more time with you would only make things more painful. Hey, um, don't be so down. I'm not saying that because I'm worried about you. I said that because it affects platoon morale. Wakana wasn't from this time period, so her situation was different than yours. The uneasy feeling I had when we unraveled the entanglements 11 years ago was because Mother's entanglement still remained. Oh. That's strange. Wakana has returned, so how come it didn't disappear? Have all the entanglements truly been unraveled? All the entanglements we felt we unraveled. The ones 11 years ago, 50 years in the future, and the one during Yakumo Sumeragi's time period. What? What does Yakumo Sumeragi's time period have to do with anything? I think one formed when we witnessed Yakumo's assassination. What are you talking about? Yakumo was severely injured in an accident, but he wasn't assassinated. We don't really understand it either, but we saw Yakumo Sumeragi being killed by Karin. What did you say? We were busy dealing with the entanglement, but yeah. There's no doubt in my mind that that was former Major General Karin. He copied Kasane's power. Yuito, if he also copied your power. But he didn't copy my... <sighs> could have time-traveled by resonating Kasane's power with mine. So it hasn't disappeared because of the entanglement Karin created when he traveled back to Yakumo's time period? But the two of you couldn't find an entanglement. How do you expect to unravel something you can't find? Karin can unravel his own entanglement. Yes, exactly. The only thing we can do is take Karin to the Kronos Terminal and have him unravel the entanglement himself. Wataru, can you check Karin's location? I figured you'd ask, so I've been working on it. I've got nothing. I can't find him at all. It's like he's disappeared. Supposing that he's traveled to Yakumo's time period, that would mean he's in the past. That's where you're going to find him. Are you too sure the people you saw were really Karin and Yakumo? We're sure. We could see their faces clearly. Actually, we only saw Karin's face. But that was Yakumo. I mean, he had the same mask on as all the depictions of him. Ah, uh, yes, that's it. The mask. That explains everything. Kagura, explain. Whoa, Sugumi, calm down. So, you know how Yakumo started wearing the mask because of the injuries he sustained? Rumor was, sometime after the accident, he suddenly stopped appearing in front of people and his whole personality just changed. Whole personality changed? You're not suggesting... The real Yakumo was assassinated by Karin from the future, and Karin took his place by putting on the mask? It doesn't matter. Either way, we still need to travel back to 2,000 years ago to check. Actually... No, we might not have to travel at all. You all saw my brother's video, right? Don't you remember what he said? Yakumo Sumeragi is alive! What are you... He is asleep, deep beneath Suo. Even now, he is waiting for his revenge! Right. Cold sleep. Just like Kagero. 
If Yakumo is in cold sleep under Suo, then we can find out the truth by meeting him directly. If former Major General Karin replaced him, then he'll be the one down there in cold sleep. I'm not entirely certain as to why he did what he did. But we can talk to him and have him help us unravel the entanglement. Do we know where he's sleeping, though? I mean, Arahabaki is the only area I can think of that's under Suo. I mean, Sumeraki Tomb is the first place I thought of where Yakumo would be. Do you think he would really be in such a heavily trafficked place, though? How about it, Yuito? It's your family's tomb. Yeah, that makes sense. But I've never even been inside the building before. The head of the family is responsible for watching over Sumeragi tomb. I might be able to find something out if I talk to my brother. The chief! Do you think he'll listen to us? Actually, I've been trying to reach my brother's terminal, but I'm not getting through. There's a chance he might have blocked me. Wataru, can you ask Major General Fubuki to talk to my brother? I doubt he'd refuse a call from a Major General. Okay, leave it to me. I just don't know how soon I'll get a response. Wanna stop by our hideout then? I'm sure Yuito and Kasane could use the rest. Good idea. It would be smart to rest while we can. Thanks, Gemma. All right, let's head back. Welcome back. I messaged Major General Fubuki. He said it might take some time to get in touch with the Chief. Thanks, Wataru. I also asked about Major General Karin, but apparently Major General Fubuki doesn't know anything either. I see. Then I guess he really is in the past. We don't have any other leads at the moment, so let's hope he's in Sumeragi tomb. I want to talk to Luca for a change.
Yuito, want to take a walk around Suo with me? Okay. I was just looking to blow off some steam. Great. Let's go then. I mean, I wouldn't say we've reached peace yet, but it's still relaxing to walk around this city. Yeah, I really like Suo. It calms me down when I'm stressed. Me too. I hope we can truly attain peace one day. In our next story, new information has been uncovered regarding the inhumane experiments conducted at the OSF hospital. That news. OSF hospital chairman Yanagi Ichijo had denied any involvement. But among the leaked data provided by a whistleblower included documents signed by Mr. Ichijo himself. It's unlikely that the ten members implicated in these accusations, including Mr. Ichijo, will be able to avoid any fallout. It seems like the researcher we saved came through. Yeah. The Ichijo family name could be ruined now, but that's better than thriving through evil deeds. How is your family doing? Have your parents experienced any blowback? No. I contacted them, but they really didn't know anything about it. They were actually worried for me that the OSF might try something. I'm glad they're okay. Yeah. I'm so relieved, because for a second I was worried they could be involved. Maybe I'll go visit them soon. What was that sound? It sounded like a crash. Let's go check it out. Over there! An accident! A traffic accident? That's unusual. Excuse me, do you know what happened here? It seems like the car's auto drive program malfunctioned. The rescue team hasn't shown up yet. Are you with the OSF? I guess that means you can't really do anything. <sighs> Let's get a closer look. Yeah, there might be something we can do. Help! My son is in one of the cars! He's still trapped inside! There's smoke coming from the engine. The kid could be in danger unless we get him out. We don't have time to wait for the rescue team. Let's do what we can. Help! Just hold on a little longer for us. We're going to get you out of there soon. <sighs> it's locked. Can you remove the door with your psychokinesis? I could, but I might accidentally hurt the kid if I try to force it open. If only there was a way we could open it more gently. Okay, I'll try then. What are you going to do? I'm going to use my pyrokinesis to see if I can melt one of the parts inside of the door. That should make it come off easier. Okay, do it. Am I going to die? Don't worry. We're going to save you. Trust me. Can you back away from the door for me? Okay. <sighs> Yuito, you're up. Got it. Here we go. <clears throat> Good job. Your mom is waiting for you. Mom! Thank you so much. I really can't thank you enough. Please, you don't need to thank us. I'm glad your son is safe. Um, thank you for saving me. Hey, I saw what happened. The OSF sure is amazing. Let's hear it for the Scarlet Guardians. What? When did this crowd gather? Everyone, please step back. It's still dangerous. The rescue team just arrived. I think we can leave the rest to them. As much as I want to see this through to the end, we should leave before the crow show up and get in the way. Whew. You were really cool. You acted so decisively, even when that was our first time dealing with an accident. What? No, I didn't. I was just desperately trying to save that boy. Well, I still think that's cool. Thanks. I think I figured out what I want to do. You finally got your answer? Yeah. I had an idea, but today really solidified it. I want to protect what I love, though 
I don't mean someone specific. I love this city and the people who live here, and I want to protect all of them. I don't want any of them to suffer. <laughs> I agree. I'm done with all this sadness that keeps happening. That's why I want to change the OSF first, so that what my uncle did will never happen again. I mean, they call us the Scarlet Guardians. We need to live up to our name. Guardians? Just like you were back there. T don't tease. But you might be right. Protecting people doesn't just mean fighting. I mean, even if we get rid of all the others in the world someday, accidents like that will still happen. Get rid of them all? I never thought that far ahead before, but you're right. In other words, our fighting ends when we defeat all our enemies. But protecting people is a job that will never end. Wow. I'm so impressed that you'd think so far ahead. I'm proud to be your childhood friend. <laughs> I mean, it might be a big endeavor, but I plan to start little by little. Besides, I only started thinking about these kinds of things because of you. I didn't have any ideals up until now. Seeing you run ahead, I wanted to catch up and run beside you. Then I finally found the path I was looking for. <laughs> what? I never thought for a second I was running ahead of you. Since I came in as a volunteer soldier, I've always been frantically trying to catch up to you. <laughs> then I guess we both helped each other grow. Let's go with that. Both of us will keep moving forward. Yes. This is the all-important first step, after all. Yuito? Huh? What is it? There's something I want to tell you when I feel like I finally caught up to you. What's that? It's a secret until the time comes. A secret? I don't really understand. But okay. I'll wait. Thank you. <laughs> Well, I'm going on ahead. Hey, wait up! Oh, she's already gone. That's so Hanabi. Thanks, Yuito. For what? I didn't do anything. When I see you working so hard, it makes me want to work hard, too. I think I've matured a little, but it's not enough yet. I'm not just going to follow after you. I'm going to get better than you and pull you up to my level. So you better be ready. Get stronger together. <laughs> 